Hey everyone and welcome back to another video and in this video I'm going to show you how to connect your Samsung Smart TV to your MacBook Air. Now this video is going to be particularly useful for individuals. Let's say that you want to go ahead and share this web browser screen or basically just your MacBook Air screen onto your Samsung Smart TV. How do you actually go ahead and do that? Now before we begin guys, do make sure that your Samsung Smart TV and your MacBook Air is connected to the same exact Wi-Fi network. In addition to that, you want to make sure that your MacBook Air is up to date with the latest version. And in order to do that, you're going to go into your system settings button, which is this right over here. And then you're going to click on general. And then you're going to click on software update, which is this button right here. So two things to start off with. Make sure they're both connected to the same Wi-Fi network. And make sure that and make sure that your MacBook Air is up to date with the latest version. Now the next thing that you're gonna do is that you're gonna go back into your settings tab here, which is this icon right over here, system settings. Click on control center, and then under screen mirroring, click on always show in menu bar. Now this is the way that I prefer to do it just because I screen mirror a lot. But once you do that, this little icon up top here is going to appear. You wanna click on this, and then click on your Samsung Smart TV. So you might see a variety of different devices here depending on what you can mirror your MacBook Air to. So here I have my Apple TV and then here I have my Samsung Smart TV. If you click on Living Room TV, you'll see that it now mirrors what's on my MacBook Air, okay? So now I can share this web browser page onto my Samsung Smart TV. Some other settings to take note of is that if you click on that same exact icon, which is this little icon right over here, you can either mirror your MacBook Air onto your Samsung Smart TV, or you can use your Samsung Smart TV as a separate display. So you'll see both those options right over here. But then lastly, in order to actually stop mirroring, what you'll do is that you'll click on the icon and then you'll just re-click on your Samsung Smart TV and that actually stops the mirror. But that right there, guys, is the best and easiest way that I know of to actually go ahead and connect your Samsung Smart TV to your MacBook Air. If you guys know of a better or easier way to actually do this, let me know in the comments down below. I would love to know. But thanks so much for watching everyone and I'll see you guys all in the next video.